It's fascinating to me about history. Things sometimes may be illegal, but not immoral. Mm -hmm. So this is one of those times in, in history where the person who was in the wrong was actually in the right. Mm -hmm. For sure. ready to get on the bus to take it over to Harbors Ferry and we used our national park pass right, right there today and it it has already paid for itself like before even today but we were able to get in for free with our national park pass. That's right. This senior pass or any national park pass will cover your full entrance fees into this national park. They charge $20 per vehicle, but that does include a shuttle bus. But again, if you're a, if you have the senior park pass, all of that is included with the price of your park pass. I've been in the right place, but it must have been the wrong time. I just said the right thing, but it must have used the wrong line. I've been in the right trip, but it must have used the wrong car. We've gotten to Harper's Ferry and we're walking from the bus station um, into the main area downtown. But uh, what's the first thing that you want to go see, Michelle? Um, I want to eat. <laughs> lunch. She wants to see lunch first. <laughs> All right, the Rabbit Hole Cafe, it's number 21. So it's right there. Okay. It's like just up the road. Great, let's go. Outside if we can, yeah. We're waiting for our food at the Rabbit Hole Cafe here in Harper's Ferry, West Virginia. And you got a wine, do you remember what it is? Uh, the, the name is this long. <laughs> it's, it's a that long name wine. It's from Austria, though. it's quite good. Quite good, very crisp, refreshing. And I got the, um, I think it was the Almost Heaven, Heaven. Almost Heaven Amber Ale from, I think it was Misty Mountain brewery and it is quite tasty and uh, we both got burgers coming almost heaven west virginia blue is mountains shining no river life is old older than the trees younger than the mountains growing like a breeze Behind us is the relocated fire hall that is known as John Brown's Armory during his 1859 raid trying to abolish slavery. And it was here that they held this place for almost two days. And then the Marines ended up storming in, killed many. You noted it was his son too. Yep, yeah, his son was with him. And, um, and it basically says on the sign that he said to his son, if you die, you die in a good cause. His son was 20, 20 years old. 20 years old. And then later John Brown was hanged for um, treason and sedition. It's fascinating to me about history. Things sometimes may be illegal, but not immoral. So this is one of those times in, in history where the person who was in the wrong was actually in the right. Mm -hmm. John Brown's body lies a-molding in the grave. John Brown's body lies a-molding in the grave. 
John Brown's body lies a moldering in the grave. His soul goes marching on. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. His soul goes marching on. He's gone to be a soldier in the army of the Lord. He's gone to be a soldier in the army of the Lord. He's gone to be a soldier in the army of the Lord. He's so Find. This used to be an alleyway <laughs> between two buildings. That's crazy. Sometime after 1860, the alley was dismantled. It was then covered by fill, a floor, and later a concrete pad. Was that an old fireplace? Yeah, it's talking about there's different markings here. So you've got the the lines of bricks and then, but it's been bricked over. So they're saying that through time, there was stages of the fireplace. A pipe hole cut into the chimney suggested a stove replaced the fireplace as the primary heat source for this building. So they bricked over the fireplace to probably insulate it better. Everybody's got a problem that they don't know how to solve. Like life don't make no sense at all And everybody feels something that nobody feels Hurt and take some time to heal So we chose to park at the tourist center location and take the tour bus drive down to Harper's Ferry. It was great. It was it was really good. Very educational. Yeah. Very well done. Um, we were there a little bit later in the afternoon. There were no in the middle of the week, so no historical interpretation programs going on. But great signage, and uh, we had a great lunch at the restaurant. Yeah. So that was really good. I know at the beginning of the video we mentioned about the America the Beautiful Pass, the National Park Pass, and I had the senior lifetime and. I'll tell you what, a couple of visits like this, and this is gonna 100% pay for this pass. This has been amazing. And then, what is it, I booked into that one um, um, Corps of Engineers, Army Corps of Engineers yeah. park, and the amount I saved on that was twice what this pass costs. So this is more than paid for itself. Highly, highly recommended. And we would recommend the bus because there's ample parking space here, and it was a nice ride on the way in. They played an audio of some of the history of the town and um, you didn't have to drive and didn't have to figure out a place to park. It's a very narrow, teeny space roads down there. So there's yes, it no, is. Not, not a lot of place to park, let alone a big truck. No, they said you could park at the train station but people actually use that train station to go into work. So it's a it's an Amtrak, it's a commuter train, and hit or miss if there's any spaces. But if you can come to the parking here, then you can either walk or take the shuttle bus in, and the shuttle bus worked great for us. Everybody's got a problem that they don't know how to solve. Like life don't make no sense at all. And everybody feels something that nobody feels. It didn't take some time to heal Something that weighs on your mind When any 
consolation isn't easy to find But you never want to show it and you keep it concealed 